There are six to eight keys that would help you become more productive and give you a productive life. And I promise you, if you follow these keys, your life is going to transform and you are going to be more productive. Feel free to drop a like on this video and make sure you watch it to the very end so that you don't miss anything in this video. So let's get right into the video. First key is to say no a lot. Say no a lot because a lot of times, so many people would come and tell you one thing or the other. They would try to make you do some certain things or take advantage of you. Or you being able to say no thank you are not interested. It sets you apart. It shows that you have principles and it shows that you are disciplined. So don't say yes to everything because at the end of the day, you have the life to live. So you need to decide what you accept and what you do not accept. So you should learn to say no as much as you can. Another key that will help you to become more productive, another story key that would help you to become more productive is to wake up early. Wake up early. So many times you go to bed late and then you wake up late. So instead of you spending time scrolling through Instagram, viewing Instagram models or wasting time doing meaningless things online, why don't you take out time to go to bed early? So that when next you wake up in the morning, you are you are waking up early and you are strong, ready to conquer the day. So that is a key you need to follow. You need to learn to wake up early. Limit interruptions. Limit interruptions. There are some certain things that would interrupt you and try to derail your attention and your focus. So you need to limit it. Most of the time, if you set out a task that you want to achieve and then your phone is beside you while you are focusing on what you are doing, a notification could come into your phone and then you are interrupted and you carry the phone and you start checking your phone to see what's happening. And before you know it, you spend hours on your phone and you have abandoned the tasks you had to do in the first place. So make sure you limit the interruptions. You can put your phone on DND. Yeah, put your phone on do not disturb so that you focus on the tasks you have at hand. Now, this one is very, very important and it's something that you need to start to practice then is to learn from your mistakes learn from the mistakes and also learn from the mistakes of others you don't necessarily have to make the mistake for if someone has made a mistake in the past learn from it so that you wouldn't make that same mistake because if you don't learn from your mistake you tend to repeat it again and again and you find yourself in the same situation you were in the last time that thing happened so make sure you learn from your mistake and don't beat yourself about it. If you did something wrong, oh yeah, this, I messed up here, I messed up there. Learn from it and then you move on and proceed to do other things that are much more important. Now, this stoic key is very, very important that you understand it and you apply it in your life. And it's for you to stop caring about what they think. Uh, what would they say? If I do this, if I should... Um, if I should start my business, if I should talk to this girl, if I should start a YouTube channel like this, or if I should just do something, what would people say? What would they say? If I should dress like this, or if I decide to grow up my beard, what would they say? People would always people would always have what to say. That shouldn't stop you and that shouldn't derail you from achieving what you set out to achieve. So instead of you depending and waiting for them and trying to please them and just bruh stop caring because at the end of the day it's your life and you are the the the, the person that is actually living the life and not them so if this is what you decided in your heart that you want to do go ahead and do it and i guarantee you if you care less about what people think you'll be surprised how much things you can have done and accomplish in your life. So make sure you follow this key. It's very, very important. And last but not least, make a little progress every day. Improve every single day. Get better at it every single day. Every single day, you should try your best to become 1% better at whatever you set out to do. 1% better. By the time you, you look back and see how long you have been doing it. You would have seen that you've gotten so much momentum and you've learned a lot. You've improved drastically. 
For example, you say you want to start lifting weight. If you do it the first day, it is not going to be nice. You feel pain. It's going to hurt. And you wouldn't see any result. But if you continue, you are improving every day, getting the form correctly, continue going out, lifting the weights. After a while, your body starts to change. You begin to notice improvement in your life. So make sure you learn to improve and progress every day, making the progress every day. So that's it for me today, gentlemen. I hope these story keys would be helpful to you. And please, if you have other story keys and stoic ideas that you know would help us to become more productive in our day-to-day activity, feel free to drop it down in the comment section. And also, don't forget to like this video. So make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Because a lot of people that are watching my videos are not subscribers. So kindly hit the subscribe button. It's free of charge. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. And always remember, you are priced.